Joyce, before we went to break, you were talking about the trial. Do you feel that justice was served in this case? I do. I think that um, it was served, except that they, their parole comes up and up, and I'm just hopeful that they never really get out. Mm -hmm. What were they sentenced to, Joyce? I don't know, like their entire life okay, okay. For, for this. And um, the one man I don't think was really, the one person I don't think was such a terrible person, but the other one, but we don't really know who shot who, so. Because mm -hmm, mm -hmm. they won't, they, they would never say mm -hmm. what really they happened. They each accuse the other of doing mm -hmm. it. Joyce, if you, so, could, if you could be face to face to those men, do you have any idea what you would say to either one of them? Um, you know, there's just no way to speak to anyone because their their mind is entirely different than mm -hmm. than yours. Anybody that does that is in a different realm. Mm -hmm. Then you you can't talk, you can't speak as mm -hmm. um, as a as a person or a mother or anything. It's like speaking to somebody from outer space. They have a different mindset mm -hmm. and. So you wouldn't even want that opportunity? I wouldn't, no, I, I really wouldn't want that opportunity. I think that that the people who, who, the prosecutors and the people in the state of New York did a great job. And, um, you know, they were responsible and they caught them, which is pretty amazing. Good. Pretty Good. amazing. I was, I'm, you know, we're all very happy. It changed a lot of the, the, um, the lives of my family. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, everyone has a different way of, de way of dealing with it. And, but uh, we've all sort of come to terms with it um, in our own way. Mm -hmm. And um, I have a, a, a door in my mind that I don't open. So I can talk about it, but I can't open this one door. Mm -hmm. You know, I can't go there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's, it's just pain, too painful. I just don't allow myself to do that. Was and the yeah, that door is the door. The door. Of what, what what happened? Mm -hmm. Actually, was happening there. I can't, I can't go there. Right, right. And um, that way, I can. I'm, I have no idea why I can do that, um, and why some people just would keep reliving this thing constantly in their mind, and you know, become totally depressed or obsessed or whatever. And in fact, I don't really know why. Um, I've, I've been able to do what I've done um, in light of that, except that um, that's just who I am. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You know, I, I, can't, I can't really explain it. Mm -hmm. Some people have um, the power to overcome things and some people just don't. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Well, and you had... It's personality, maybe, yeah. but you don't really know that until right. it happens to you. Right. Well, you had the yeah. power to overcome it. You're, you're a very strong woman, Joyce. I, I admire well, it, you. It's, I, we don't know how strong we are, but we just can... To me, I don't feel like I'm really that strong. It's just that I continue to go on. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. My father said once, not about this in this situation, but he said, you don't look back mm -hmm. you have to keep moving forward mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and never stop moving. <laughs> Those were, there were two things he really said. Mm -hmm. And he lived till he was 96 and he was very, you know, active. So I try to remember those things. <laughs> Absolutely. And now Joyce, you were here in Key West at the time and, and then soon after this, you started the Nutcracker Key West. I mean, it was a couple years, but mm -hmm. did you kind of find some, some coping? Through the situation I by think doing so. that, well, I I think that um, it's important to have something that you care about that is meaningful to you and to um, fulfill that, mm -hmm. no matter what happens, mm -hmm. no matter what happens. And a lot of things happened to me in 2001. My life changed. My marriage was over of uh, 40, almost 40 years, and. Um, uh, my dog died, and my daughter died, and my sister died, and <laughs> I left my home and started a whole new life. But the only thing I can tell you, really, is that I have a lot of energy. <laughs> and I still have a lot of energy. And um, 
I, I'm waiting till that runs out, but it hasn't run out yet. <laughs> no, so, I think I, that's even an understatement to say you have a lot of energy. Joy, you have so much energy. I was like, I was <laughs> even when I was little, they couldn't like, they would put that on my crib. Lack self-control <laughs> <laughs> on my report card. Like I have a lot of energy. And that's what ballet dancers usually have. They have lots of energy because it takes so much to be able to to dance and, mm -hmm. and that's that's really who I was. Okay. Now after the year 2001 though, Joyce, how long after everything happened to you did it take you to get that energy back and to become yourself again? You know, I always had it. I never lost it. In mm -hmm. fact, I I had more. I was it was not like I was wired, but like if I just kept moving, I couldn't feel the pain, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think. Mm -hmm. But then that was a savior, too. There's a lot of people who have great tragedies in their life in the United States where they can get the food at the local delicatessen or whatever. Um, you know, they don't, have to, they don't have to fight for their very existence. They either overeat oversleep or over drink, mm -hmm. go to drugs, whatever it is, they find a crutch. Mm -hmm. And my crutch actually was was occupying having projects, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think. Well, that's that's good and fortunate. <coughs> Interesting for us. thing. Mm -hmm. Kind of an odd an odd way to to um, to approach it perhaps, but um, that's what I did. I, when I look back I can see that's what I did. Well, like I said, it's fortunate for us, though, because then you created the <laughs> Nutcracker Key West for us. Joyce, it has been a pleasure talking with you this morning. Thank you so much for being on. And Good. Joyce, I think you are inspiration not just to me, but to anyone out there who's lost a loved one. You're living proof that you can get through it. If you don't look at the past, look at the future. Yeah, well, you, you know, it always comes back, mm -hmm. but you can, I mean, it, it comes back. You're always, you're living with, with that, but... You have to keep, you have to keep going in a positive way. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Thank you again, Joyce. I'm going to take a quick break right now, but there is still more to come this morning. Stay with me.